Daytona 2012 Student Life Camp. Uh, it's gonna be great. We get to, we last year or there at Daytona we got to listen to Louis Giglio speak and uh, listen to Chris Tomlin and his great music. We all got to worship and spend some time together on the beach. Um, we had our own little our own little classes, I guess you could say. Um, it was just a great experience last year, and I, I already know it's going to be 10 times better this year. I just want to thank the church for uh, taking us and supporting us and praying for us. I am excited about going to Daytona this year with my youth. I didn't get to go last year with them, but I, I heard it's pretty fun, and I just want to get there and listen to Louis Gigolo talk. I, I've seen him in concert before with Chris Tomlin, who else is going to be there. and. I just want to get closer to the youth and get closer to God, most importantly, and just have fun out on the beach with my youth and just have a good time. <laughs> okay, I'm Alexis and I'm excited for Daytona 2012. This is my first time going. I've heard a lot about the experiences and it seems very awesome. I'm excited to get a lot, a lot closer with God and with the youth. I'm new here and I can't wait. And I want to thank the church for being so generous and with a lot of donations and money. And I thank you for letting us go. And yes, I can't wait to come back and um, tell about my experience and hope I'm close with God. Okay, I am excited to become friends with everyone, like closer friends with everyone, and to get to know everyone. And I'm excited because I haven't been before. I've been to Daytona, but I didn't go like, with the group last year, and I'm excited to hear like the message with a lot of people. That's basically it. I haven't really been to Daytona, but I've heard really like a lot of great things about it. But um, I'm expecting to hear like some really good speeches from Louis Giglio because I heard that he was an awesome speaker and that he really touches people. Hi, I'm Brittany. Um, I'm excited to go to Student Life Camp this year because when I came back last year, I was on fire for God and I just want to get back to that place where I was again. And Chris Tomlin and Louis Giglio are awesome. And I can't wait to get closer to our youth and there's more youth going this year so I can make more closer friends and we'll just have a great time. And thank you, Duke Point Second Baptist. Um, I went last year and it was a lot of fun and I learned a lot about missioning to others and how to keep up with my faith and not to be ashamed of Christ dying for me and to witness to everybody around here, not just in Florida or across, across in a different country. And this year I'm going as a student leader, which there were some new challenges because I'm not just a student. I have to be able to help others if they have any questions and not that I'm a legit leader but a student leader and I should have to show more responsibility and <laughs> um, show be a good image so they can look up to me not you know be talking about inappropriate things not letting gossip get by and you know I'm excited to <laughs> witness on the beach and I'm excited for Louis Giglio and Chris Tomlin because they were awesome last year. They can make an atheist a believer. And so I'm really excited to get close with the new youth members because I work a lot so I've been able to come. And I'm Jesse Watts and I approve this message. Hello, this is Jacob Jesse speaking. And for the Daytona trip, I am mostly excited about the 16 hour drive with Smelly Kids. Um, push ups on the beach and uh, probably just counting sand and collecting shells, um, possibly shark fishing. But what I really want to do is uh, witness to people and uh, I guess go listen to Chris sing some songs and uh, listen to Louie talk. That's probably the best part. I can't wait to sleep with um, all the men in the room. It should be fun. But anyways, uh, I'd like to thank you guys for letting me go on this trip, and it was a it was a really good time last year. I learned a lot. I grew spiritually, and I hope that I can do even more this year. Thank you. What's up? I'm David. How you guys doing today? 
Well, first things off, uh, I like blonde, preferably blonde. Uh, I like long walks on the beach, uh, classy, classy scenes, you know, the weather has to be perfect for a beautiful day, for a beautiful woman. And wait. Dude, this is a, this oh. is a, this is for Daytona. Oh, this isn't the date video? No. Oh, alright, never mind, alright, alright, alright. Let me sc scratch that, start over. You got it? Recut? Alright. Hey, what's up guys? I'm David. Uh, what I'm looking forward to Daytona most is definitely sharing the Word of God with other people. Last year, me and my dad shared with someone. It was a really good experience. But that's the number one thing I'm looking forward to. I think that's what we're supposed to do, our main goal. Spread the Word of God. Um, other than that, definitely our like personal gains, like going to the concerts, uh, listening to Lou Giglio, paying attention, definitely getting on fire and bringing it back to Duke. Coin and Daytona, um, and then other than that, you know, hanging out on the beach with friends. I mean, that's definitely, definitely really fun. Everyone loves the beach, and uh, maybe catch a couple of sharks with my dad. You never know. Uh, that's it. Thanks. My name's Billy, and um, I'm really looking forward to going to the beach with uh, my youth because I really want to get closer to them. I feel like it'd be a really good experience for me because. Um, I'm just been going through a lot of stuff and I just really hope to get close to God, um, closer to God, I should say, and um, just hope it's all good and fine with my friends. Hey, I'm Connor. I'm PK, pastor's kid, preacher's kid, whatever you want to call me. Um, and I would just like to say uh, I'm ready for Daytona. Last year we had a fantastic time. We uh, went on the beach a lot, got to see Chris Simon and Luke Giglio. That was a lot of fun, you know, got to grow close to the youth, but, you know, let's get ready for this year. Uh, <laughs> I'm ready to go out on the beach, obviously, have a lot of fun with the youth group. Hopefully, when we're out swimming, there's not, like, a jellyfish migration, so, like, I hope, like, there's not jellyfish stinging everybody, or, like, a great white shark migration, that'd be bad, too. Um, you know, odds are that's not going to happen, but... Hopefully we come back with some shark. My dad's gonna catch some of those. I'm gonna be out there too, catch them with him. Hopefully it's a full moon phase, you know. They'll bring in the sharks. All right, but anyway, besides that, uh, I'm looking forward to having a great time. I'm sure we're gonna definitely grow close to God and have a great time uh, ministering to other people that need to hear the word of God. And uh, this is a do work approved, do work. I do work, I'm Connor Eaton, I do work. And do work approves this message, thank you. I'm Be Will. Um, I love Daytona because it's the one time of the week that I get to just let everything go and just give it all to God. Uh, I was really strong after Daytona, so that makes me more excited about it this year, especially strong in God. And I just, I just want to feel His presence even more than what I do now, and I just want to give it all to Him. Um, I love Daytona because it's like a vacation, but it's like we're doing it for God and not for ourselves. And I love to witness to others, especially when we were on the beach and we prayed. That was probably one of my favorite parts of Daytona last year. Uh, I just want to go there this year and I want to I want to let Jesus shine through me and do my best to witness as well as I can with the Roman road and my testimony and not be afraid. I, I really want to just change lives like it changed mine last year and I hope that the people in our youth group take it just as seriously as it should be because it's an experience of a lifetime and they really, really just need to just let everything go. All the mistakes, all the problems, it's gone because Jesus forgives you and that's, he was the only one that was perfect. Oh, okay. Bye. Hi, I'm Brandy, and I went last year, and this year I'm excited to meet new people and get closer to the new youth, and also get closer to our more close to our old youth and have a fun experience. My name is Tim, as you all know. Uh, I'm looking forward to camp because. Uh, well, probably the same thing as last year. Uh, 
It's kind of like a vacation, but uh, just the whole time you're just uh, surrounded by God, it feels like, and He's constantly on your mind. You, uh, you're there with your friends from youth, and uh, you're always uh, growing and stuff through the week, and uh, you know, you go outside and there's the beach, and that's really beautiful, and going to worship services and stuff like that. It's, uh, it's really cool because just all week you're just constantly uh, having God on your mind, and uh, being away from here, uh, do coin and just uh, being somewhere else and uh, just having your mind on different things and not having uh, the stresses here on you and it's just really nice and uh, I'm just really looking forward to being surrounded by God and uh, you know having a fun time with my friends. So y'all I'm pretty excited for this year you know to go to Daytona and get on fire for God again. Um, it was real fun last year praying on the beach and witnessing to people and Hey, just having a good time with all my youth, you know. And we're having some new people come this year, and I'm pretty excited to get close to them and learn some new friends with God, get to know them. And I, I really want to, I didn't witness to enough people last year, I don't feel like, on the beach. And I, that's my goal this year is to save some lives, you know. And I'm really excited to see Chris Tom and Louis, Louis Giglio. He, he's a pretty, pretty good man, you know, real close to God. Change people's lives, and I'm just excited to get on fire for God again. America!